Risen, ascended, yet present, Lord, we come a people scattered and confined, thankful that you are a God freed from the constraints of time and space, whose desire is to see your kingdom come on earth. And so we pray for our world as it seeks new ways of living and relating and being through this time of pandemic. May it be a time of recreation, reformation, and reshaping from all that we've known to becoming something new. A world characterised by love, kindness, and compassion for our neighbour. May your kingdom come, may your will be done. We pray for leaders across the globe in their decision-making and for their advisors. May your wisdom, selflessness and courage inform their thinking and their actions. May your kingdom come, may your will be done. We pray for those in need, holding before you those struggling with and possibly suffering through being locked down locked in. We pray too for those in the medical and caring professions, living with the serious emotional impact on their own lives caused by what they are experiencing as they tend the sick and sit with the dying throughout this COVID crisis. We also hold in your love those who are ill, thinking particularly of all who are unable to see their loved ones at this time, robbed of the most precious human contact. And in a moment of quiet, we remember those we know and love. May your kingdom come, may your will be done. We pray for the church of which we are part, witnesses to the whole world of who you are, Help us as we seek to make Christ's presence real and bring hope in the midst of trauma, fear and profound questions of pain. May we be chin tilters, enabling people to lift their eyes beyond their restricted and individual circumstances, to glimpse the liberation possible in Christ, to find their place in the story of God of life and resurrection. May your kingdom come, may your will be done. We pray now for those who are mourning the loss of loved ones. May they know your loving presence, bringing comfort, strength, and a measure of peace as they walk through the dark valley of grief. We also give thanks for the life of those who have died that we love. May they rest in peace and rise in glory. And for ourselves, Lord, may we rise each day with you and live always for you and in you as you live in us. We ask that you equip us to share your love and make you visible through the power of the Spirit so that your light blazes in the darkness and your kingdom might come reconciliation between heaven and earth. Scattered but united, we bring these prayers, our prayers, into the heart of the Father, who with the Son and the Holy Spirit loves us and gives us life. Amen. <laughs>